Very good morning to everyone and welcome to the launch of the documentary Uncovering Mangrove Ecosystem Services in Suriname. I'm going to be doing this in English today because we have English speaking people in the room to make sure that everyone understands what um, this is all about. My name is Rosita Leeflang and I'm uh, the chair lady of uh, Stichting DAF, Stichting Develop Art Foundation. In May 2017, after months of preparation, we from Stichting DAF signed an agreement with the UNDP that gave us permission to execute the project Uncovering Mangrove Ecosystem Services in Suriname. This project is funded by the UNDP, the Surinamese government, and the European Union and, ex and is executed in three stages. For the first part, we headed to Nikeri, Coroni, Paramaribo, and Comoena to survey almost 900 locals. We gathered information regarding the knowledge and awareness of Mangrove ecosystem services, participation in relevant activities, opinion in Mangrove management in Suriname, and dissemination of information about Mangrove ecosystem services. For the Second stage of the project, consultant and trainer Edie Lemmers developed a very basic training manual that we used to train 55 locals, 30 women and 25 men in the four districts during six weekends. <coughs> during the training, they were also given information about the mangrove in Suriname by environmental specialist Shikita Rizomardono. Trainees then received a camcorder and were asked to work in groups and start filming mangrove in their surroundings. The footage we received often blowed our mind. The angles, the interviews, and the distance they went to tell their stories. In some cases, we did have to leave the camcorders again because some of the footage could not be used at all. Where youngsters were involved, we asked parents to join in and assist in bringing together the material. After we received all the footage, I went over the material with Edi Lemmer and spent many hours determining what to use and which darlings to kill. It resulted in four mini documentaries, one for each district. We took these documentaries to the trainees for their approval. But it also resulted in very in-depth discussions with trainees and guests that were at the viewing. After all four mini documentaries were viewed, we combined the material in the documentary you are about to see. To sum it up, the documentary you are about to see was completely shot by amateurs. We in no way filmed any of the footage. It was an incredible experience doing this project with a lot of lessons learned. A few of those lessons I would like to share with you today. Amongst the trainees, we had resort, resort council members that were planning to take the information into their own line of work. During the training, we gave a session on how to use your mobile phone to make movies, setting up a YouTube channel, and bring your message across. An eye-opener it was, also to the resort council members who wanted to use this info to their advantage. In all of the districts, we had a local coordinator. In the case of Komoweine, it was Yves Chon, the chair of the United Tour Guides. Participating in the trainings as well, he learned how to make short movies, and used it to his adv advantage as, and is even using the information in his work with tourists. He started documenting much more with thanks to this project. Highly educated people don't want to be part, didn't want to be part of our survey. Mostly making time for them was at the issue here. There is a great need for information about the mangrove 
but more in a way the public can adapt to. They really appreciated the discussions we had during the surveys. In Baki, Kamoweina, we heard stories from the trainees that they are now more engaged in telling people not to litter their surroundings. In one case, they saw people in a boat dumping trash just before getting out of the boat. They summoned the people to get the trash out again. On short term, we see that trainees are more aware of the mangrove, of the mangrove and its ecosystems and are taking personal actions when needed. I will not keep you longer from watching the documentary, but let me take the opportunity to thank the UNDP for trusting this project to Stichting DAF. Along the way, we learned a lot and are planning to keep doing projects concerning our environment. I also thank my team, Shekita Resomardono and Leticia Fernand, who could not be here this morning, and Wendell Margaret for the long hours. I thank Edie Lemmers, the trainer over there, <laughs> for training and editing the district, for training and editing. We also thank the district's coordinator, Sherida Mormon, Marjolaine Paviro Regio, and also Yves Chonsaki. Thank you to the district and resort council members and to all trainees. Last but not least, for Courtyard Marriott, with whom we will plant a mangrove tree today, of which we hope will be a start of a lot more planting. A special thanks to Adley Breveld, Gillian Bapp, and Heidi Malona for their patience working with us. And thanks in advance to the press for sharing the information with the greater public. We believe it's not too late for our mangrove. Stop using single-use plastic, for it is very bad for our environment. Thank you. I also need to thank one person today, especially two persons. Um, we gave a lot of training concerning the mangrove, and what we saw is that a lot of people don't really know how important the mangrove are. We needed music for the documentary, and so we called upon one of our youngsters who uh, went in the studio with another youngster and created the mangrove tune. We would like for him to perform it also today for us. May I um, have an applause for Crazy G and also for K Mac? <laughs> who produced the song for the Bangrove. Nogmaals, my name is Crazy G, meer bekend als de man met de gewone gekte en de gekke gewoonte. En het is voor mij een hele eer om vandaag hier te mogen zijn. Ik wil een hartelijk applaus voor de organisatie van Rosita Leeflang. Verder wil ik ook uh, mijn producer bedanken, K-Mac, die die geweldige beat in elkaar heeft gezet voor deze team song. Maar ik ook een applaus voor Kemi. Ja, en voordat, voordat we verder van start gaan met die pokoe, wil ik de mensen vragen of we allemaal wakker zijn. Zijn we wakker? Are you awake? Are you awake? Are you awake? awake? Yes. Oké, okay, jullie zijn wakker. Ik ben de grens, toch? Ik wil aan deze kant graag dat Men dit met me meezing. Koru winte wai, hebi squalai dry. Fisi mange breiti wan si parwa denge fenden dry. Hebben jullie het? Gaan het weer proberen? Oké, okay. oké, okay, nog een keer. Rustig. Koru winte wai. Zeg maar na. Hebi squalai dry. Fisi mange breiti wan sei parwa denge fenden dry. Fisi mange breiti wan parwa denge fenden dry. Nog een keer? Nog een keer? Of jullie kennen het al? Ja. Oh, die meneer dan nog een keer. Oké, okay, kijk. Koru winte wai. Hebi squalai dry. 
Sisi mange breiti wan sei parwa denge fenden dry. Goed zo, onthouden. En aan deze kant wil ik graag horen. Koru winte wai, hebi squalai dry. Tegi lanti funo prat concessie pe mi parwa lai. Nog een keer? Oké, nog een keer. Koru winte wai. Hebi squalai dry. Tegi lanti funo prat concessie pe mi parwa lai. Oké, okay, het wordt een battle, hè? We gaan kijken wie flinker is. Technisch. En als je hem voelt, mag je lekker mee swingen op de beat. Maak een beetje meer volume. Dank je wel. Laat maar handen, alle handen zien, alle handen, alle handen. Oh, oh, oh. Opnieuw, 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 opnieuw. Opnieuw. Opnieuw, rewind. We willen alle handen zien. Alle handen, alle handen. Jullie zijn wakker toch? Laat me zien dat jullie wakker zijn. Laat me zien dat jullie wakker zijn. Oké, okay. spin it. Ja, 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 ja. Parwa mangro en Akira, van mijn net schild voor de kus. Mangro voor bossen zorgen en voor dat even gestormen worden gesus. En waar de straat wordt weg op kus. De golven van de zee Zeggen wordt het laat moeder aarde met rust Ik wou wakkie de modder niet gaat hier met je mee Voor een week Heb je squalai Visi mange breedi Want zei paar wat denk je ver Voor een week Heb je squalai Visi mange breedi Want en nu jullie Voor een week de wai Heb je squalai draai Zeg het maar eerder, verhoog van je omplaats van in die echt eerder. Dat is toch niet eerlijk, nee. Kom, roep je. Alle handen, alle handen. Visie. Hey, hey, hey. Kom, roep je. Kom, roep je. Zorgen en voor dat even gestommen worden gesust En waar de strand wordt weggekust Door de golven van de zee Zeggen wortels laat moeder aarde met rust Ik bewaak hier de modder niet gaat hier met je mee Assyrië enkele, waar ook de mangrove Dus na een jaar dat je zegt mangrove Dus na twee jaar nu Dat we hier moeten aan Arutulu 
बस वो गोपरा ने लेके जाने That's not me, Ella. No. Go to win the white. A bit small, I try. This is my break. The one say, Parwa, then a friend, they try. Go to win the white. A bit small, I try. This is my break. The one say, Parwa, then a friend, they try. Go to win the white. A bit small, I try. Take it, land the food, no prat, concessi, pay me, Parwa, like.